everyone welcome back to my channel my name is DL and today I am going to be cash stuffing a total of $370 this is again going to be a quick cash stuffing just because I do have to get back to work there are a few little changes that I made I'm not sure if my next video after this is going to be another cash stuffing or if it will be my new setup I did purchase a Moterm wallet, the A7 sized, and I did purchase new envelopes. So I hope to get those before next payday. But again, if not, then I'll do another cash stuffing and then the video after that will be my setup. But anyways, let's just get started. I will quickly give you an overview of my budget this week. This is going to be my February February paycheck number one. I left all of my bills already in my account. I don't plan on cash stuffing that and just keeping it in my account because it's just easier for me to track of it. Again, if you missed my um, last video, some changes to my salary is that I do get paid every week now, which is awesome. So here is a very, oops, a very quick overview of my budget. So these are the categories that I have, and then these are the amounts. So up here are my bills, and then um, these are the amounts that I will be stuffing. So. Um, before I get started, actually, I did want to mention that I do have this new every fifth day challenge that I'm doing for this year. I already filled some of it out already off camera, but I am going to fill the 30 and the 15 with you guys. Okay, so let me just go get my cash and set it up real quick. So I know I did say I am stuffing 370, but I actually took $39 to put in gas already. So I'll be stuffing only $11 in gas. So that's why it's kind of an odd number. So first we are starting with my normal envelope. Spending is actually gonna get something today. It is going to get $30. So 30 is all spending has. Church is going to get a 20. Groceries is also going to get a 30. Gifts is how much are you getting gifts it's gonna get a 10 and now gifts has 20 40 50 and 60. miscellaneous is not getting anything but miscellaneous has 5 10 11 12 13 14 left over Car maintenance is going to get 10 as well. So now it has 20, 40, 50, 60, and 70. Kovu, which is my dog, is getting a 10 as well. And now Kovu has 100, 10, and 20. Travels. Travels is going to get 10 as well. I do have to bump travels a little bit more because I am planning to go to the Philippines and Korea in October. 
and I need just enough for the flight first and then the pocket money I can worry about a bit later when October is sooner. But for right now, I do want to get the plane ticket hopefully by next month or by April the latest. So Travels has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. Parents is not getting any. Oh no, yes. Parents is actually gonna get 150. And now parents has 150. Beauty, it is getting nothing this week, but it does have 20 and 40. It's not doing anything. Christmas is getting a 10. And now Christmas has 20, 40, 50, 60, and 70. Electronics, are you getting anything? Yes, you are. $10. So... Electronics, electronics now has 20, 30, and 40. Gas is going to get, again, it was supposed to be 50 for this week, but I've already put 39. So now it's just going to get $11. Um, and then splurge. Are you gonna get anything? Nothing. Challenges. This is my 100 envelope challenge. It is getting a forty dollars. I actually deposited the 1000 that I had last week and just put this placeholder. This is from Pixie Lax Planning. I bought this from her Etsy shop maybe over a year ago and so I've just been using this and then it has a thousand fifty already so now it's going to get an additional forty. It has 1,000 in the bank, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. So $1,090. Emergency fund is going to get a 20. This has a post-it because I did lend $300 to my brother. And so he owes that to me. So that's just a note to remind myself that that's where the 300 came from. So I have 120 in here, but then plus 300 that my brother owes me. So that's 420 in emergency fund. Perfect. So this is done with. Uh, the next thing we're gonna do is the every fifth day. This is from Caffeine and budgets her etsy shop i love it so much and i actually really love her shop to the point where all of the envelopes that i bought for my new wallet and then for all of my binders are coming from her so i can't wait for them i think she does really great quality products so january we are gonna do $30. Now I'm just going to color it in now. Perfect. So 20 and a 10. And so this month is done. And now we have a total of 
20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105. January, so that is complete. I don't know if I'm gonna actually keep this in here or if I'm going to take the balance out and put it towards debt because I do plan on being debt free at least with my credit cards this year. So we'll see what I do with this. I do kind of also want to wait it out until the very end of the year to count everything. But at the same time, I don't know. I don't know, we'll see what I do. Um, but for February, we are putting $15 in. So what we're going to do is we're just gonna take this five out and then just add a 20. Yes. So now there's $30 in here. And now we are going to color this in. Perfect. And then last but not least, I have this binder. So I've had this binder for quite a while. I just never used it because I didn't know what else to use it for. But I've binge watched Budget Me Alex and she actually has this debt method that I kind of liked. Not kind of, I did like it to the point where I actually purchased her, um, her stuff. So what I plan on doing is I have all of my credit cards here and I plan on still putting in my monthly payments, um, still well above the minimum, but I also am going to take a portion of my paycheck and putting it in these envelopes so that at the end of the month I can do a bigger payment for the credit cards and I am planning to do it one at a time. So for Quicksilver, I have $80 already. So what I am going to do is add another 30. So now Quicksilver has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 110. Perfect. And I have left over money because I forgot to stuff another challenge that I got. So at the end of this, I have the treat yourself challenge. I don't know if I'm gonna actually treat myself with this or use it again for debt, but I decided to just buy this again from Caffeine and Budgets. And I am going to add, I don't have change. Give me one second while I go and get change. Okay, came back with change. So treat yourself is $50. So I am going to stuff. 50 and then I am going to color this in. Oops, it's fine. Doesn't have to be perfect. Perfect. Okay, and I'm putting this in. left over $35 that I have no idea where this is supposed to go. <laughs> Can you tell that I have not done this in quite a long time? Ah, I know where this is supposed to go. I don't have an envelope for it yet, but 
I also plan on doing a month ahead and I kind of, it's not a priority right now, but I do want to build it. So I am putting $30 in here. And then the $5 that I have left over is on purpose actually, because I can only do increments of 10 when I took it out, took my money out of the ATM. So $5 I'm going to put in spending. Why not? Perfect. That is all for today's video. I'm sorry that it was a mess. Give me a couple of videos before I can get this all settled. Again, I'm not sure what, what my next video is going to be, if it's going to be the second paycheck of February or if it's going to be my new setup. But either way, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys so much for watching, for sticking around. And if you guys are new, please subscribe, like, comment. Um, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.